What's up, everybody? It's April 31st, and... April 31st? Yeah, what about it? I'm recording! There's no April 31st. It's May 1st. No, that can't be true. Yeah, it is. You mean I missed the last day of Veda? Yep. Good job. Ah! What's up, everybody? So, yeah, it is May 1st, not April 31st. There's no such thing as April 31st. And I missed the last day of Veda. I couldn't make the last day up, so I am going to put this up today, which is March 1st. But it's kind of ironic. I guess it's it's fitting that I missed the first day, so I missed the last day. I had a job a few years ago. It was my first job in education, actually. And I was late on my first day, and I was late on my last day. And I remember my boss at the time, really cool guy. I mean, it was there was no reprimanding or anything. He reminded me, I got in late on the last day of work, and he goes, oh, this is the fitting end to you working for here because you were late on the first day we hired you, and now you're late on the last day we have you here. So uh, maybe that's just my thing. Maybe I like to be late on the first and last days. I'm generally on time, which is why it's kind of odd. In that case, I was late both of those times. So I want to thank my wife for helping me for the opening of this, this very dramatic reading, how I'm feeling about internally about the fact that I missed the last day of Veda. This, is, this was my first attempt at Veda, so I feel like I did pretty good. I'll end up with 21 videos out of the 30 days, and I can honestly say that that is more content than I've ever produced in a month in my whole life, except for the time that I wrote 53,000 words in a month for one of my novels. But other than that, by far, this is the most content that I've ever created. A lot has happened in the month of April this year. I started April in a very good place at my job, when, and I felt like things were going really good. They were going uphill. I thought that I was going to be working there for you know, the coming school year. Unfortunately, things did not work out there, and it was there's no bad blood between me and the people I worked with. I have personal things that needed to get taken care of. She had to worry about her business, or not worry about, but think about what's best for her business, and we, we parted ways. But this has also allowed me to pursue working for myself, which, if you haven't watched it yet, make sure you watch my Stressful to Successful number one which uh, came out last Wednesday. I'll have a card up in the top that's like, I don't know, one of these two sides. I think it's um, this side. Yeah, anyway. So yeah, watch that and you'll kind of understand what I'm what I'm doing and what my YouTube channel is going to basically be about going forward. I will still be doing personal blogs probably once a week. I will be doing gaming probably once a week with the exception of Let's Plays, which I'm going to put up constantly. But I'm going to focus on answering questions about writing, about publishing, and mostly things in the creative sphere. I'm also going to be concentrating on my Stressful to Successful videos, which will come out at least once a week. These will be a mixed bag of content, ranging from vlog-style videos where I talk about what's going on with my entrepreneurial journey to interviews, which I have my first interview scheduled for next week. Also, I'm going to have Q&A where you ask questions, I answer them live on, or not live, actually I'm considering doing live, but on the videos and just a plethora of different types of videos. So really, if you are an entrepreneur, if you are interested in writing, interested in publishing, that's where this channel is going and that's where I want to take it from here on out. So that kind of answers the question that we have today is, are you going to continue videos every day? And the answer for me is, is a, a big no, I'm not. I couldn't do videos every day. I couldn't do videos every day for a month, let alone continuously. The fact that I got 21 videos out in 30 days, again, to me, that is a huge success. To me, that that was a huge accomplishment. I am looking forward to August when we're doing um, video every day in August. I think that by that point, I'm going to be more ready with my own content. And if I'm already having two to three videos a week, then filling in the gap shouldn't be too hard with random videos. But Veda truly has been an amazing experience. 
I've, I've said this in probably three or four videos this month, but I've met some amazing people online, and even though the numbers dropped off around day 14 or 15, I'm still seeing you know people always commenting on my videos, giving thumbs up, and I really appreciate that, and I'm going to continue to go to pages that I've been going through all month, assuming they continue their content. I'm actually pretty far behind on my YouTube videos. I haven't been on YouTube in about three, four days since before I put up my last video actually and so I have a lot of catching up to do it's one of my priorities between tonight and tomorrow because I want to finish off Veda the way that I started it and that's going to all these interesting new people's pages checking out their videos and I want to see what they've accomplished in their 30 days and how they're feeling I'm really hoping there's certain channels that I'm really hoping are going to continue producing content and there's some that I probably, I'll be honest with you, I probably won't continue to follow after this last weekend. But I think that that's, that's the nature of YouTube. But for the most part, I'm going to pretty much follow, continue to follow everybody that I found during VEDA. I could go on and on all day about the people I've met, how much this has influenced me, but I think that that's a pretty good ending to VEDA. So I'm going to cut it here. And I hope to continue seeing all of you guys on my channel and... I hope you enjoy content and I hope I can bring you something useful, not just personal tidbits about my own life. So please don't hesitate to leave your comment about what you'd like me to do on this channel in, in the sense of my writing, publishing, or entrepreneurial journey. Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up for an awesome VEDA. And if, you ha if this is the first video you're watching, it's it's probably kind of odd, but I hope you enjoyed it, and make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'll be back real soon with another video, probably in the next two days, so I hope to see you back then. <sighs> Trying to get work done. Sasha! Let's go. Really? You mean I missed the last day of Veda? Yep. Good job. Ah. <sighs> Was that it? I don't remember my own script. Yeah, you don't remember your own script. I'm like, what are you talking about? What's up, everybody? It's April 31st, and... What? Oh, well, it just died. What's up, everybody? It's April 31st, and... What? I wrote my, read my line. Where, where's yours? In an and. I'm like, what? It's not there. It's okay if I read... Okay, I know. I was, like, put off for that. I was like, I thought you were, like, going to start okay. over. No. So when I say start saying and... I don't like you're a horrible this Yes, I actor. am horrible. Shut the up. That's why I don't do this shit. Okay, I'm out. You're, that was a trap. That was a test. Why is it a test?